don't think that God doesn't accept those little offerings. Those are great things to God. But when I began to realize that my life not only has significance now, but for all eternity, that gave me a new lease on authentic life. I had a reason for living. Indeed, life is worth living. When you come to realize that you're living in Christ the Lord, that you're called to share in his inheritance, the inheritance of the children of light, what a blessing when you interiorize that. And you don't have to do great things right where you are. No matter what your duties in life, your state in life, no matter how insignificant, the great Carmelite saint, St. Therese, gave us her little way. She talked about the fact that she couldn't do great penances. She just wasn't able to. But So she sought to sanctify every little thing. So if she was washing the dishes, she would offer that to the Lord. And don't think that God doesn't accept those little offerings. Those are great things to God. You know how it is, moms and dads. If you have a little child, and that child, who is basically poor, doesn't have anything unless you give it to them, they bring you a little weed, a daisy or something. Well, it's not worth a heck of a lot in itself. But isn't your heart touched? Of course it is. What's important? The one who's giving you the weed. It looks like a flower to them. I used to give my mother bouquets of dandelions. <laughs> and she had hay fever. 